today we're going to be trying out a waterless wash, particularly one from, yep, Chemical Guys. This is our EcoSmart RU uh, waterless wash and wax with Carnuba and UV protection. So we're going to be trying this out on the O4 Mercury Sable and it may look clean, but it's actually really not that clean. Especially if we come back here, if you look, you know, in the finer details we have, you know, really some road grime. I think uh, I I drove this uh, through the rain one day last week, so, but it's been dry ever since. And I haven't had time to wash it off because I've just been busy with work and all kinds of other stuff. So we're gonna try some of this wireless wash out on this today. I'm just letting you take a good look. We're gonna do a good before and after. We're gonna do the whole car. As you can see, it's up here on the rear deck lid as well. You see the impurities in there. So it's all the way around. There's some there. That's all, all down the side of the car. Just giving you a quick before and after here. Okay, so we're gonna get started. Uh, my materials I have with me, I have these. I just bought these. These are microfiber towels. In fact, you can tell they're brand new because they still have a tag on them. Uh, so we're gonna try this out. These are just El Cheapo uh, ones from Swipes on uh, Amazon. So we're gonna try these out with the wireless uh, wash and wax and see how good it goes. Okay, a little bit of time later here and we used about, I'd say, close to three, three fourths of the bottle. And I must say this stuff is uh, rather nice. Uh, you just really spray it on, wipe it off, then uh, buff off all the extra, because there is wax in this. It's also uh, got a nice scent to it. I think it's apple or something that they put in it. it smells really great. So now we're gonna do a once around. Uh, this is the after shot of the Eco Smart RU. So we're gonna go around here real quick. I even did the wheels. So we can, if we look down here in these problem areas I pointed out last time, looking great, a couple scratches and stuff. That's going to be polished out here for too long. So if we know the rear quarter of the car was the worst contaminated, um, and I didn't have to use hardly any effort at all to um, get this stuff to work. Uh, it worked like magic, if you ask me. Uh, well worth the money. Um, I probably could have used a lot less product, but this was my first time using it, so we'll leave it at that. But I really like this stuff. I think it turned out pretty well, and this paint is really, really smooth now. You can barely hear. You know, it doesn't sound like there's any grit or anything on there. So I think it left a nice wax uh, protective over top of the wax I already had on the car. So yeah, this stuff has done really well. roof all nice and clean and I know the weather isn't really all that great today it's pretty cloudy and it's going to be raining here before too long I just wanted to get this stuff done before the rain got to it I mean the only thing I want to get with rain is just rain water so and yeah there's little speckles and spots of little like rock chips that turned into rust I want to get those fixed here too before too long got a bug on it the wheels front bumper I had bugs and stuff up here I don't know what's on the bumper I think it just I think it's some paint etching I bet you if you took a really heavy clay bar and some real um, gritty compound I bet you all this stuff here would come out uh, this was here when I got the car so we'll disregard that that's not their fault and that's cleaner obviously can't get that off it's in the paint for quite a while so miscellaneous rock chips this is a daily driver and it is driven on the interstate four days a week uh, 60 miles round trip so you can actually see a real good reflection even though it's a cloudy day you ain't got the mirrors with it you grill on that side. So 
So, would I buy it again? Yes, I would. This uh, can save a lot of money and time. I had this whole car done within 20 minutes uh, versus a half hour to 45 minutes if I do a bucket wash and then you know drying it off you got another 10 minutes there if you know what you're doing so yes i would definitely uh recommend this product and once again this is from chemical guys it's their eco smart ru ready to use wireless wash and wax with carnuba or uv protection cleans shines protects and it has sure done all that and i believe this bottle is i think 9.99 it might be less than that actually uh, I just bought it on Amazon. I, I was going to buy it off their website, but believe it or not, I think it was cheaper on Amazon, so I got it on there. It, like I said, it also has a real nice scent to it. It's got an apple, it's like an apple type scent. It's not, not a cleaner smell, so it's real, even the paint kind of smells like it. It's a real pleasant smell. There's some stuff on the back. If you want to pause the video and take a look. Look, you can even look at the video they made on it. They put a QR code on there, isn't that neat? So, we're gonna look here. If you look in the bottle, the let's see if I can increase the brightness. See this stuff in the bottom of the bottle, this blue stuff? That's actually the clay that's in it. That's the Kylon clay. Some of it's obviously settled in there pretty good. Uh, but I figured I'd show you that as well. But this is really great stuff. I like it. Uh, well worth the money save me time and stuff. I think I'll be using this probably throughout the winter on my car just to uh, Save a little bit of elbow grease and from going through those dang gum automatic car washes that cost a Lot of money and can potentially hurt your finish uh, with the uh, acid that's in the soap so Yeah, I would say this stuff's pretty good would definitely buy it again And that's your review on the chemical guys you go smart are you see you next time folks